Hello and welcome to BNC Sports. I'm James Hill. College football, the Big 12, according to the University of Texas Athletics Department, the Longhorns have parted ways with Coach Tom Herman. The Longhorns have a new sheriff, a new coach. You're looking at the Texas football Twitter page. Quote, welcome to Texas. Steve Sarkeesian, head football coach, end quote. The Texas Longhorns are gearing up for a new era of Longhorns football. Hook them, as they say. The Outback Bowl in Tampa, Mississippi versus the Indiana Basketball Hoosiers. The Rebels defeat the Hoosiers at Raymond James Stadium by a final score of 26 to 20. All right, the Gator Bowl, Kentucky versus North Carolina State. Fourth quarter, speed kills. You're checking out Zonovan Knight, 13 yards into the end zone. Wolfpack Nation loves it. They trail 16 to 14, still in the fourth. Hockman throws the football pick. And Jamin Davis with the interception. The Kentucky Wildcats, too hot to handle. Kentucky upsets 23rd ranked NC State. Wildcats 23, Wolfpack 21, your final. Last check at halftime in South Florida. Texas A&M leading UNC 17 to 13. Aggies running back Isaiah Spiller already putting in work, folks, with two rushing touchdowns. All right, NBA news. The pro basketball community is mourning the loss in the life and times of NBA legend Paul Westfall, the basketball player turned coach. Paul Westfall is gone at age 70, according to a statement from the Southern California. He died in Scottsdale, Arizona. He's a five-time NBA All-Star and a Pro Basketball Hall of Famer. Westfall played guard as a six-foot-four guard at Southern California for the Trojans. With the Boston Celtics, he actually helped capture the 1974 NBA championship as a player. He's also remembered for his time with the Phoenix Suns. All right, NBA Kings at Rockets in H-Town. Second quarter, John Wall in the house goes in and flips in the deuce there. 51-47 Houston. Here's De'Aaron Fox with the spin move. Boom, he goes upstairs on the slam dunk. 96-85 Rockets at that point. Later in the fourth, check out Kristen Wood. He seals the deal for the victory. Nice dunk there. He comes over from Detroit. Folks, he can play. Houston Rockets 102, Sacramento Kings 94, your final. Finally, it's time for our BNC King of the Hill. He's a former Southeastern Conference baseball, football, and track student athlete. In the big leagues, he breaks baseball bats after striking out. In the NFL, he ran with speed, power, and grace. Bo Jackson is our BNC King of the Hill. Vincent Edward Bo Jackson was born November 30th, 1962 in Bessemer, Alabama. Jackson is a three-time All-SEC football star. He's also a two-time Consensus All-American. Bo Jackson wins the Heisman Trophy, highly coveted back in 1985. Bo Jackson was drafted first round, first pick overall in the 1986 NFL Draft by the Los Angeles Raiders. The Raiders started out in Oakland, moved down to L.A. for 10 years to the Coliseum, moved back to Oakland. Nowadays, you can catch them over in Las Vegas as the Las Vegas Raiders. In four NFL seasons, Jackson rushed for 2,782 yards. He scored 18 touchdowns. Bo knows baseball from 1986 through 1994. He played with the Kansas City Royals, the Chicago White Sox, and the California Angels at the Big A in Anaheim. 141 home runs, 415 RBI, and 82 stolen bases. Bo knows baseball, Bo knows football. His two-time sports career was cut short due to a hip injury. Bo Jackson is our BNC King of the Hill.